Okay, a South Texas dance group is preserving Latino heritage through carefully choreographed folkloco dancing. Three News anchor Barbie Leo shows us how, step by step. Every dance has a story behind it, and every story has its roots. Al Cortas Compañía de Danza en Percorta story begins 25 years ago. So our story begins with my mother, Cynthia Alcorta. She started a ballet folclorico program at Roy Miller High School, and from there it moved into a, a large-scale project. Um, we had many dancers from leaving that project of that, of that school folklorico program, and they didn't have anywhere for them to dance after they graduated from high school. And so there was a long a need in the community for some sort of outlet for Mexican folk dance. Growing up, Samuel and Sasha Alcorta recall the studio which their mother, Cynthia Alcorta, founded back in 1997, being a home away from home. And since her retirement, both brother and sister have committed to carry the Alcorta Folklorico's legacy of preserving Mexican history with each dance step. Teaching Mexican folk dance, meaning dances of the people. Helping students connect to their heritage through dance, music, and costume. I have these students come in and they are ready to dive into their culture. They're ready to pick up their skirts and move their feet and learn why it's so important to do what we do. Using dance as a form of storytelling, sharing the stories and traditions of Mexico's 31 unique states and keeping them alive. They're learning about the different types of music, the different postures that people have in different parts of the country. Um, they're learning about the costuming, they're learning what they should, uh, how certain movements should move if they're from one part of a region versus another part of a region. They're understanding a lot more of their cultural heritage that they might not get from uh, academic instruction or from home life. And with each leap, turn, and stop, students promote diversity and educate the community through their performances. And what's unique about our company is we don't dance for the sake of dancing to look pretty on stage. We dance with the intent to educate our community. As an audience member, you only see the end result, not the hours of training, sacrifice, and focus. You also miss the priceless moments being made backstage between mothers and dancers. It's not only a mother getting a child ready for a performance because that's what a mom does is take care of her babies, but it is the mother bringing culture to her child. And filling them with pride as they pass down their stories and culture from one generation to another with each vibrant dress and ribbon tied. When I'm getting my daughters ready to perform, it just gives me a sense of pride um, for who we are, from where we came from. To Alcorta's Compañía de Danza Folclórica, Folclórico is life. Folclórico is family. And familia es todo. Barbie Leo, 3 News. Ballet Alcorta will be performing tomorrow at the Island University's Performing Arts Center at 6 o'clock as part of their Hispanic Heritage Month celebrations. The event is free and open to all.